Morning campers, Thursday, big day today, we're off to the museum and then we've got fuck all to do for the rest of the day. <laughs> so um, the big news is um, on day six my um, latrine consistency was at a level of about eight for solid. Pretty good. But we've gone backwards today. I've just been for my uh, morning brown turnout. And we've gone back to a three. But I did have a lot of um, West Indian hot pepper sauce on my steak last night. So, fingers crossed, we'll be back to a six or a seven tomorrow. But anyway, I'm looking forward to the museum because I'm 55 and I'm fucking dull. <laughs> No, they've got a lot of history about the tin mines and St. Agnes. Big Ray's busting for it. So let's see what today brings. Hope you're all having a good day at work. You know, making the man richer. Laters! All right, lovers. Well, I, I've been down in I've been down in Cornwall for about a week now, and I've got ten brothers and nine sisters in one week. And my 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 dad is my uncle. It's been beautiful getting a family. It's getting a family, so. We're staying down here, down here in Cornwall, and we're going to start selling. This is fucking genius. We're going to start selling mobile phones that fucking work. <laughs> yeah, so we're staying down here. My eye, thanks for asking. Fuck it, oh, thanks for asking. Took my eye out with a kayak. Big Ray did. She took my eye out with a fucking kayak. Or. She took my eye out with a kayak. Or she did. Because I says, fucking, crack on, girlfriend, crack on. And she fucking twitted me. She twitted me right in the eye. So I had to go to Toro Hospital. And they says, do you want a glass eye? Or do you want a Japs eye? I says, I don't want a Japs eye. I've already got one of them. One of them. I says, I've got one of them. Look, look. look. Oh, we can't show you that, can I? <laughs> Anyways. Over and out. And then we got to go back to Scunthorpe. Which I didn't want it because I love living down here. As a, as a young adult Hitler with a patch. Good boy. How do I turn this off, Rachel? How do I turn this off? Is it that or me? Morning, campers. How we doing? Sun's out again. Happy days. So this is um, this is our last night on site. Um, Report on um, latrine consistency today. We're looking at about a three, to be honest. It's not good. But we did have an Indian last night. So we're uh, back on the pasties today, and then it should be all right. You want to go and eat? So I was just asking Big Ray. I says, have you had a good time? He says, yeah, really good. It's great to share your company in an enclosed space, as you can imagine. <laughs> but she's looking forward to 
a bath and her own bed. Uh, and I'm trying to think, what am I looking forward to the most? Two things. Not shitting in a cupboard, but more importantly, the one thing I cannot get used to is when you walk from here to up there, where your ablutions are, saying, morning, 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 when you want to say, fuck off. Yeah, just stop talking to me. I don't know you. I'm never going to meet you again. Anyway, over and out, we're off to the Rattler Cider Brewery. Slurp, slurp, and then gig tonight. Catch you in a bit. Ta-da. From the Love Shack. Baby. <laughs> we get a fully grown apple into a bottle? Push it. You'll find out the answer soon enough during this tour. I want to know now. Cider was first made here approximately 100 to 150 years ago. No. But the farmers in those days were making cider for their own enjoyment and to pay the wages of the men who worked for them in the fields. Cheeky bastards. The average farm labourer would consume approximately four to five pints of cider a day. And during the summer, harvest time, it is very likely they'd be drinking double that amount. I as that. Nine to ten pints. I as that before breakfast. So you can understand why it is well known that the farmer who has produced the best cider also got the best workers. See you in a bit. My there are three main things we are looking for in our apples. The origins they is. Acidity, sugar, and tannin. The acidity for the apple's flavor and the bite. The sugar to be eaten by the yeast, producing the alcohol. And thirdly, the tannin, for its rich flavour, colour, and... They had to walk to work. Once they got to work, they had to climb down the steep vertical ladders... There's, get there's Aberdeen Angus, that is. As there were no winding engines in those days to work... Gee, little sparrow here. He's gonna get crumbs off my, uh, my cheese scone. Hey, you cheeky little bastard. Little bird. Big bird. Little bird. Big bird. Right. Maids that way, but that'd be a bit of me do that. Handsome, that's me, I's handsome, and I need a piss. Oh. He's going to go in there and check the consistency level of my shit. Wow. Rich playboys. You got keys, Rich? Who's that next to you? <laughs> As if you didn't know. <laughs> As if you didn't know that was there. <laughs> what a fucking idiot. <laughs> you, no, no, you can sit where you like. Down the wheel. You can get in. Just mind him behind you. He's been known to scare people. So, I don't know whether you're allowed in here or not, but Rich is having it. She's gonna bust the fucking thing. The only one left in the world is she'll break it. So, press start. 
Oh, ho, 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 ho. Honk the horn. Oh no, number two, number two, accelerate. Number three. Whoa. Flash the light. We're all over it. Use the indicators. Yeah, winky tickers. And the other one. Oh, the other one's gone, bulb's gone. Only one side's working. Just give it another rev. Floor it, Rex, floor it. Floor it. Floor it. How excited is she? I can't even get in it. <laughs> Look. Look, yeah. <laughs> Just like watching Daisy Duke get out of the Robbery Lee. Uh, I'm all right, thanks. Oh, that's better than Wonka Factory, isn't it? Ram your chocolate, give me cider. Beautiful. Look at them all. And if you work down there with a high vis on, you get to look up at lasses in skirts all day, up, don't you? And Nick Sider. Give me a job now. Ah, yeah. Uh, have you calmed down? She nearly put her back out getting out of the car. Colostomy mouth. So instead of having it in bottles, it comes in a bag. Brilliant. Oh, look at that. That's basically your bladder after about three hours. Yeah, she's full, mate. Bit more, bit more. Um, pop the lid on. Chuck it in the box. Cut that. And there you have a box of rattler. <laughs> this is all very, very impressive. I'm coming. Girl, Rich is going, eh, 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 eh. Superb. Look at that, a horse used to pull that. Just to make bloody cider. None of that strongbow shite here. <laughs> oh, get me to the shop. Wow. Great. One year matured, five year matured, ten year matured, twenty year matured, forty nine years immatured. <laughs> <laughs> Bloody lovely. Crap. Mm. I know what you're trying to say, fold you bastard. It's 
Go on, fall, you bastard. It's called Dalt's New Diamond. <laughs> Morning campers. Oh, hey, it's time for us to walk off. So we're just in the pub car park having uh, a cup of morning brown. Um, and then, yeah, six hours, six minutes it's saying, but I can't see that happening. Not on a Sunday from Cornwall. Everybody's going to be heading back out there. But it is what it is. As long as we're back to watch Scotland tonight at 8 o'clock. Um, gig went well. Um, I was amazing. Um, Rach did all right. Did... One sec. Hi, yeah. Uh... Morning. Did you enjoy it? Yeah. Hey, looking forward to spending six hours in close proximity to me shouting at you. No. I tell you what, she does a lot. It's like, <gasps> fuck him! I'm fully aware of everything peripheral, the lot. She seems. Did to... you just say peripheral? Yes. And point it to your ear? No, I didn't. There, I was scratching I'm my fucking head. My bloody case. Yeah, she seems to think I'm going to fucking hit everything. The only fucking thing I'm going to wear is her. <laughs> yeah. I'll fucking rattle her. Anyway, um, yeah, thanks for coming along on the journey. It's been a blast. Uh, I'm looking forward to um, getting out in my camper van on my own. But uh, thanks for joining me, Rachel. You've been... Oh, you're welcome. You've been good company at times, uh, but it's been hard been the cabaret all the time you know what i mean just all the time but hey you know it's what i do snap me a knife i'm like a stick of rock it just says entertainment